All right, so this is the clavicle here, and you can actually see it kind of has this S shape here. There are really three primary structures on here that you're going to need to be able to identify. Uh, this bulbous region right here, which attaches to the clavicular notch on the sternum, this is called the sternal end. Uh, the flat end right here, uh, this actually attaches to the acromion process on the scapula, uh, which is why it's called the acromial end. And then this process right here uh, that is covered by a silver star, uh, that's the conoid process or conoid tubercle, depending on uh, the book that you use. Uh, this is going to actually orient you to knowing which is the top and the bottom. This will actually be found on the bottom of the clavicle. So the appropriate process uh, is sticking downwards. Now, uh, the S shape, actually this curvature here, you see it, uh, this should actually stick outwards. So this is actually the anterior portion and this is actually the posterior portion of the clavicle. And that tells you that um, this should actually attach to the, to the uh, acromion end, which is where the arm would be. Uh, and this will actually attach to the sternal end, which is where the sternum is. And this being the, t the top and that being the bottom. So this is how it should actually sit in the body. Okay.